You can now officially start filing your tax returns. As of today, the Internal Revenue Service is accepting both electronic and paper returns. And this year, you have a little longer to file. Since April 15th falls on the weekend, the official deadline is April 17th, so you have two more days. And with the start of the tax season, there's one big scam that you need to know about. Chris Six News anchor Priscilla Torres tells us what it is and how you can protect yourself. We all get them, phone calls from unknown numbers, but what do you do when that unknown number leaves you a voicemail like this? Hi, this is Officer Ryan Smith from IRS. Internal Revenue Service. The IRS is calling you, and according to Officer Ryan Smith, it's not good news. This is to notify you that you are under federal investigation because of the fraud and unethical activities found in the audit report of your taxes. Panic starts to set in, but as Regional Director of the Better Business Bureau, Kelly Trevino says this is all a scam. But they're not going to come knocking at your door. They're not going to call you on the phone. They're not going to bully you. Be aware. This is just one of the many scams out there around this time of the year. And Trevino says it's best not to answer the phone if you see the IRS on your caller ID. Don't try to disregard the message or else it will be taken as an offense from your side. And if you get a threatening voicemail like this, ignore it. Trevino says the IRS will only contact you via mail through the U.S. Postal Service. So if you see it's the IRS, if you really have a concern that you owe the IRS any back taxes, you can call the IRS number that is listed at irs.gov. Priscilla Torres, Chris, 6 News.